you want to go from a collection page that looks like this to a collection page that looks like this. Bonjour, bonjour, Shopify world. My name is Andrew from ecomexperts.io and the green hoodie means we're doing some Shopify code. Okay, so in last week's video, we talked about how to make a master collection page with just a collection page you wanted in your code. This week, we're going to see if we can add more products to your collection page, because maybe your collection page is limited to like six products. And you love those long collection pages with tons of products on it. So you want to increase that from six to, well, 50, because Shopify limits it at 50. So I'm going to show you two options. Option number one is hopefully you can just do this in a customizer, no code required, super basic. Option number two, we're gonna go into the code and change just one little line of code, super simple. Let's jump straight into the demo store right here. Okay, so welcome to our trusted demo store. Let's see how it currently looks. Um, we click on catalog. Here are all our, oh, that's our collection page, but there is only eight products shown and it's distributed over six pages. The nightmare. I'm never going to make any sales like this, but we're about to change that right now. The easiest way to change that is actually go into online store. You click on customize. This is the no code solution and does not work for every theme. So it's very possible that this will not work for you. For that, we'll have option two. Once you're in the customizer, choose your collection page right here. Click on collection pages. And maybe if you're lucky, you will have the option here to show more products per page. You see here, it's telling me, hey, do you want more products per row? But it's also telling me, hey, do you want more rows? So I can definitely do that. I can max this out. I can save it. And then I should have way more products on my collection page. Let's go check it out if that worked. We go see our online store catalog and indeed there is way more products now but is that the limit of 50 i feel i can add even more product but maybe you want to add even more products than your team customizer allows you to or alternatively your team customizer doesn't allow you to do what i just showed you not to worry the green hoodie and andrew is here for the rescue we're going to do some code and it's not really code. We're just changing one thing in a line of code. But anyway, all right. So we're going to go into online store themes. And first and foremost, and you have to do this every time, even if it looks simple, do this every time you go into the code, we're going to create a duplicate of the existing theme. That way we have a backup in case we screw something up. It's not going to affect our live version and we can still have a backup. We wait a bit. And once that is done, we can go into the duplicate version, click actions, and we can click edit code. Welcome to the back end of your Shopify store. So here we're going to go to templates and we're going to click on collection.liquid. Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry. It says we need to go into sections. So we go down to the sections and we do collection dash template right here. In here, the easiest way to find your code is command F on a Mac, control F on Windows, and you write paginate. Well, here we go. We found paginate collections dot products by limit. So this is basically referring to the limit of the customizer that we have inputted earlier. Now, if you didn't have this option in the customizer, it will say paginate collection dot products by six or by 12 or by 50. So actually let's change that and let's put by two. So we only see two products per collection page, which seems completely useless, but you'll get the point then. We click save. We go back to our online store. Apparently we wait an eternity. We preview the version we just saved. So this is not the same as the live version. Actions preview. And then we click on the catalog right here. 
And indeed, there is only two products on my collection page. Now, obviously, instead of two, I could have written 50, which is the limit. Again, please know that when you're loading so many images on page load, it does tend to slow down your site speed a bit. So is it really useful to show 50 images on page load? Uh, that's a little bit of a question. We'll do another video where we can change instead of pagination that it scrolls and as you scroll, it will load a new products, but that will be for another video. I hope this video was a little bit useful for you. My name is Andrew from ecomexperts.io. Make sure to check out our other coding videos with the hoodie or our strategy videos or app review videos or basically anything Shopify related. And I will see you next time. Ciao.